Why is it worse when someone in heels steps on your foot than someone in sneakers? It's not just their weight, it's pressure. Pressure equals force divided by area. A person's weight, which is the force, is the same whether they wear sneakers or stilettos. High heels have a tiny contact area, so all that force is focused at the tip of the heel. This results in very high pressure, often more than that of an elephant's foot. When area goes down, pressure goes up. A 120 pound person in high heels can exert over 1,500 pounds per square inch on your foot, more than a car tire. Yup, now you know why it hurts so much. Why are snowshoes so big and flat? The area of a regular shoe is small, creating high pressure on the snow. Snowshoes are designed to increase surface area. This helps spread your weight over a larger area, creating less pressure on the snow. Less pressure means you don't sink into soft, powdery snow. Pretty cool, right? This is the same principle that explains why camels have wide feet for walking on sand, why sharp heels sink into grass, but sneakers don't. Can you build mini snowshoes and test them on flour or sugar? Why do balloons pop more easily? When pressed with a sharp object, a balloon stretches rubber to hold in pressurized air. When you press on it with your hands, the balloon deforms but doesn't pop easily. With a sharp object, the same force is concentrated into a tiny point, piercing the rubber and releasing the built-up pressure instantly. Pop! Try testing different objects on a balloon. Can you pop it with a pencil eraser? If that does not work, can you pop it with a pencil tip? Hungry for more? Check out our other videos on this channel.